This is a reading of the Holy Quran, as translated by Malana Muhammad Ali, and read by Tissa Muhammad. This is a 30-day reading of the Holy Quran, broken down into 30 parts. Bismillah, Your Rahman, Your Rahim. Part 30, Surah 78, al Nava, The Announcement, Section 1, The Day of Decision. In the name of Allah, the Beneficent, the Merciful. Of what do they ask one another, of the tremendous announcement about which they differ? Nay, they will soon know. Nay, again, they will soon know. Have we not made the earth an expanse and the mountains as pegs, and we have created you in pairs and made your sleep for rest and made the night a covering and made the day for seeking livelihood and we have made above you seven strong bodies and made a shining lamp and we send down from the clouds water pouring forth in abundance that we may bring forth thereby grain and herbs and luxuriant gardens surely the day of decision is appointed the day when the trumpet is blown so you come forth in hosts and the heaven is opened so it becomes as doors and the mountains are moved off, so they remain a semblance. Surely hell lies in wait, a resort for the inordinate, living therein for long years. They taste not therein coolness nor drink, but boiling and intensely cold water, requital corresponding. Surely they feared not the reckoning and rejected our messages, giving the lie thereto. And we have recorded everything in a book, so taste. For we shall add to you not but chastisement. Surah 78, al naba The Announcement, Section 2, The Day of Decision, Ayah 31. Surely for those who keep their duty as achievement, gardens and vineyards and youthful companions, equals an age and a pure cup, they hear not therein vain words nor lying. A reward from thy Lord, a gift, sufficient. The Lord of the heavens and the earth and what is between them, the beneficent, they are not able to address him. The day when the spirit and the angels stand in ranks, none shall speak except he whom the beneficent permits, and he speaks aright. That is the true day. So whoever desires may take refuge with his Lord. Truly, we warn you of a chastisement near at hand, the day when man will see what his hands have sent before, and the disbeliever will say, Oh, would that I were dust! Surah 79 al Naziat, Those Who Yearn Section 1 The Great Commotion In the name of Allah, the Beneficent, the Merciful By those yearning vehemently and those going forth cheerfully and those running swiftly and those that are foremost going ahead and those regulating the affair the day when the quaking one shall quake the consequence will follow it. Hearts that day will palpitate, their eyes downcast. They say, shall we indeed be restored to our first state? What? After we are rotten bones? They say, that would then be a return with loss. It is only a single cry. When lo, they will be awakened. Has not there come to thee the story of Moses, when his Lord called him in the holy valley to walk? Go to Pharaoh, surely. He has rebelled, and say, Wilt thou purify thyself? And I will guide thee to thy Lord, so that thou fear him. So he showed him the mighty sign, but he denied and disobeyed. Then he went back hastily, so he gathered and called out. Then he said, I am your Lord, the Most High. So Allah seized him with the punishment of the hereafter and of this life, surely. There is in this a lesson for him who fears. Surah 79, al Naziat, Those Who Yearn, Section 2, The Great Calamity, Ayah 27. Are you the stronger in creation or the heaven? He made it. He raised high its height and made it perfect. And he made dark its night, and brought out its light. And the earth, he cast it after that. He brought forth from it its water and its pasture. And the mountains, he made them firm. 
a provision for you and for your cattle. So when the great calamity comes, the day when man remembers all that he strove for, and hell is made manifest to him who sees, then as for him who is inordinate and prefers the life of this world, hell is surely the abode. And as for him who fears to stand before his Lord and restrains himself from low desires, the garden is surely the abode. They ask thee about the hour. When will that take place, about which thou remindest? To thy Lord is the goal of it. Thou art only a warner to him who fears it. On the day when they see it, it will be as if they had but tarried for an evening or a morning. Surah 80, uh, Basa, he frowned. In the name of Allah, the Beneficent, the Merciful. He frowned and turned away because the blind man came to him. And what would make thee know that he might purify himself or be mindful so the reminder should profit him? As for him who considers himself free from need, to him thou dost attend. And no blame is on thee if he purify himself not. And as to him who comes to thee striving hard, and he fears, to him thou payest no regard. Nay, surely it is a reminder. So let him who will mind it, in honored books exalted, purified, in the hands of scribes, noble, virtuous, woe to man, how ungrateful is he! Of what thing did he create him? Of a small life germ. He creates him, then proportions him, then makes the way easy for him. Then he causes him to die, then assigns to him a grave, then when he will, he raises him to life again. Nay, but he does not what he commands him. Then let man look at his food. How we pour down abundant water, then cleave the earth, cleaving it asunder, then cause the grain to grow therein, and grapes and clover and the olive and the palm and thick gardens and fruits and herbage, a provision for you and your cattle. But when the deafening cry comes, the day when a man flees from his brother and his mother and his father and his spouse and his sons, every man of them that day, will have concern enough to make him indifferent to others. Faces on that day will be bright, laughing, joyous, and faces on that day will have dust on them, darkness covering them. Those are the disbelievers, the wicked. Surah 81 Al-Takwir The Folding Up In the name of Allah, the Beneficent, the Merciful. When the sun is folded up and when the stars are dust-colored and when the mountains are made to pass away and when the camels are abandoned and when the wild animals are gathered together and when the cities are made to swell and when men are united and when the one buried alive is asked for what sin she was killed and when the books are spread and when the heaven has its covering removed and when hell is kindled and when the garden is brought nigh, every soul will know what it has prepared. Nay, I call to witness the stars running their course and setting, and the night when it departs and the morning when it brightens. Surely it is the word of a bountiful messenger, the possessor of strength established in the presence of the Lord of the throne, one to be obeyed and faithful, and your companion is not mad. And truly he saw himself on the clear horizon, nor is he niggardly of the unseen, nor is it the word of an accursed devil. Whither then are you going? It is not but a reminder for the nations, for him among you, who will go straight, and you will not accept Allah, please, the Lord of the worlds. Sir 82, al infitar the cleaving, in the name of Allah, the beneficent, the merciful. When the heaven is cleft asunder and when the stars become dispersed and when the rivers are made to flow forth and when the graves are laid open, every soul will know what it has sent before and what it has held back. O oh man, what beguiles thee from thy Lord, the gracious, who created thee, then made thee complete, then made thee in a right good state, into whatever form he pleases he cast thee, Nay, but you give the lie to the judgment, and surely there are keepers over you, honorable recorders. They know what you do. Surely the righteous are in bliss, 
and the wicked are truly in burning fire. They will enter it on the day of judgment and will not be absent from it. And what will make thee realize what the day of judgment is? Again, what will make thee realize what the day of judgment is? The day when no soul controls aught for another soul, and the command on that day is Allah's. Surah 83, al tatfif Default in duty. In the name of Allah, the beneficent, the merciful. Woe to the cheaters who, when they take the measure of their dues from men, take it fully. And when they measure out to others or weigh out for them, they give less than is due. Do they not think that they will be raised again to a mighty day? The day when men will stand before the Lord of the world? Nay, surely the record of the wicked is in the prison. And what will make thee know what the prison is? It is a written book. Woe on that day to the rejecters who give the lie to the day of judgment. And none gives the lie to it but every exceeder of limits, every sinful one. When our messages are recited to him, he says, Stories of those of yore. Nay, rather, what they earned is rust upon their hearts. Nay, surely they are that day debarred from their Lord. Then they will surely enter the burning fire. Then it will be said, This is what you gave the lie to. Nay, surely the record of the righteous is in the highest places. And what will make thee know what the highest places are? It is a written book. Those drawn near to Allah witness that surely the righteous are in bliss, on raised couches gazing. Thou recognizest in their faces the brightness of bliss. They are given to drink of a pure drink, sealed. The sealing of it is with musk. And for that, let the aspirers aspire. And it is tempered with water coming from above, a fountain from which drink those drawn near to Allah. Surely they who are guilty used to laugh at those who believe, and when they passed by them, they winked at one another. (laughs) And when they returned to their people, they returned exulting. And when they saw them, they said, Surely these are an heir. And they were not sent as keepers over them. So this day... Those who believe laugh at the disbelievers on raised couches, gazing. Surely the disbelievers are rewarded as they did. Surah 84, al Inshikak, the bursting asunder. In the name of Allah, the beneficent, the merciful. When the heaven bursts asunder and listens to its Lord and is made fit, and when the earth is stretched and casts forth what is in it and becomes empty, and listens to its Lord, and is made fit, O man, thou must strive, a heart striving to attain to thy Lord, until thou meet him. Then as to him who has given his book in his right hand, his account will be taken by an easy reckoning, and he will go back to his people rejoicing. And as to him who has given his book behind his back, he will call for perdition, and enter into burning fire. Surely he was erstwhile joyful among his people, Surely he thought that he would never return to Allah, yea, surely his Lord is ever seer of him. But nay, I call to witness the sunset redness, and the night and that which it drives on, and the moon when it grows full, that you shall certainly ascend to one state after another. But what is the matter with them that they believe not? And when the Qur'an is recited to them, they adore him not? This is an ayah of prostration. Allahu Akbar, Allahu Akbar, Allahu Akbar. Subhan Rabbil Allah, Subhan Rabbil Allah, Subhan Rabbil Allah. Allahu Akbar. Allahu Akbar. Subhan Rabbil Allah, Subhan Rabbil Allah, Subhan Rabbil Allah. Allahu Akbar. Allahu Akbar. Subhan Allah. Ayah 22. Nay, those who disbelieve give the lie and Allah knows best what they hide. So announce to them a painful chastisement, except those who believe and do good, for them is a reward that shall never be cut off. Surah 85, Al-Buruj, the stars, in the name of Allah the Beneficent, the Merciful, by the heaven full of stars and the promised day, and the bear of witness, and that to which witness is born, destruction overtake the companions of the trench, The fire 
fed with fuel when they sit by it, and they are witnesses of what they do with the believers. And they punished them for naught, but that they believed in Allah, the mighty, the praised, whose is the kingdom of the heavens and the earth, and Allah is witness of all things. Those who persecute believing men and believing women, then repent not. Theirs is the chastisement of hell, and theirs the chastisement of burning. Those who believe and do good, theirs are gardens wherein flow rivers. That is the great achievement. Surely the grip of thy Lord is severe. Surely he it is who creates first and reproduces. And he is the forgiving, the loving, Lord of the throne of power, the glorious, doer of what he intends. Has not there come to thee the story of the hosts? A Pharaoh and Bamud? Nay, those who disbelieve give the lie, and Allah encompasses them on all sides. Nay, it is a glorious Qur'an in a guarded tablet. Surah 86, Al-Tariq, the comer by night. In the name of Allah, the beneficent, the merciful, by the heaven and the comer by night. And what will make thee know what the comer by night is? The star of piercing brightness. There is not a soul, but over it is a keeper. So let man consider of what he is created. He is created of water pouring forth, coming from between the back and the ribs. Surely he is able to return him to life. On the day when hidden things are manifested, then he will have no strength nor helper. By the cloud giving rain and the earth opening with herbage, surely it is a decisive word. And it is not a joke, surely. They plan a plan, and I plan a plan. So grant the disbelievers a respite. Let them alone for a while. Surah 87, Allah, the Most High. In the name of Allah, the Beneficent, the Merciful, glorify the name of thy Lord, the Most High, who creates, then makes complete, and who measures, then guides, and who brings forth herbage, and makes it dried up, dust-colored. We shall make thee recite. So thou shalt not forget, except what Allah please. Surely he knows the manifest and what is hidden. And we shall make thy way smooth to a state of ease. So remind, reminding indeed prophets. He who fears will mind, and the most unfortunate one will avoid it. Who will burn in the great fire? Then therein he will neither live nor die. He indeed is successful who purifies himself and remembers the name of his Lord and prays. But... You prefer the life of this world, while the hereafter is better and more lasting, surely. This is in the earlier scriptures, the scriptures of Abraham and Moses. Surah 88, al Ghashia, the overwhelming event. In the name of Allah, the beneficent, the merciful, has there come to thee the news of the overwhelming event? Faces on that day will be downcast, laboring, toiling, entering burning fire, made to drink from a boiling spring. They will have no food but of thorns, neither nourishing nor satisfying hunger. Faces on that day will be happy, glad for their striving in a lofty garden, wherein thou wilt hear no vain talk. Therein is a fountain flowing, therein are thrones raised high, and drinking cups ready placed, and cushions set in rows, and carpets spread out. See they not the clouds, how they are created, and the heaven, how it is raised up in the mountains, how they are fixed in the earth, how it is spread out? So remind, thou art only one to remind, thou art not a warder over them. But whoever turns back and disbelieves, Allah will chastise him with the greatest chastisement. Surely to us is their return. Then it is for us to call them to account. Surah 89, Al-Fajr the daybreak. In the name of Allah, the beneficent, the merciful, by the daybreak and the ten nights and the even and the odd and the night when it departs, truly, in this is an oath for men of understanding. Hast thou not considered how thy Lord dealt with Ad of Iram, having lofty buildings, the like of which were not created in the land, and with Thamud, who hewed out rocks in the valley, and with Pharaoh, the Lord of hosts, who exceeded limits, in the cities, and made great mischief therein. So thy Lord poured on them a portion of chastisement. Surely thy Lord is watchful. As for man, when his Lord tries him, then gives him honor and favors him, he says, My Lord honors me. But when he tries him, then straightens to him his subsistence, he says, My Lord has disgraced me. Nay, but you honor not the orphan, 
nor do you urge one another to feed the poor, and you devour heritage, devouring all, and you love wealth with exceeding love. Nay, when the earth is made to crumble to pieces, and thy Lord comes with the angels ranks on ranks, and hell is made to appear that day, on that day man will be mindful, and of what use will being mindful be then? He will say, Oh, would that I had sent before for this my life. But none can punish as he will punish on that day, and none can bind as he will bind on that day. O oh, soul that art at rest, return to thy Lord, well pleased, well pleasing. So enter among my servants, and enter my garden. Surah 90, Al-Balad, the city. In the name of Allah, the beneficent, the merciful. Nay, I call to witness this city, and thou wilt be made free from obligation in this city. And the begetter and he whom he begot, we have certainly created man to face difficulties. Does he think that no one has power over him? He will say, I have wasted much wealth. Does he think that no one sees him? Have we not given him two eyes and a tongue and two lips, and pointed out to him the two conspicuous ways? But he attempts not the uphill road. And what will make thee comprehend what the uphill road is? It is to free a slave, or to feed in a day of hunger an orphan nearly related, or the poor man lying in the dust. Then he is of those who believe and exhort one another to patience, and exhort one another to mercy. These are the people of the right hand. And those who disbelieve in our messages, they are the people of the left hand. On them is fire closed over. Surah 91, Ashams, the sun. In the name of Allah, the beneficent, the merciful. By the sun and his brightness, and the moon when she borrows light from him, and the day when it exposes it to view, and the night when it draws a veil over it, and the heaven in its make, and the earth in its extension, and the soul in its perfection, so he reveals to it its way of evil and its way of good. He is indeed successful who causes it to grow, and he indeed fails who buries it. Amud rejected the truth in their inordinancy, when the basest of them broke forth with mischief. So Allah's messenger said to them, Leave alone Allah's she-camel, and give her to drink. But they called him a liar, and slaughtered her. So their Lord destroyed them for their sin, and leveled them with the ground, and he fears not its consequence. Surah 92, Al-Lail, the Night In the name of Allah, the Beneficent, the Merciful, by the night when it draws a veil, and the day when it shines, and the creating of the male and the female, your striving is surely for diverse ends. Then as for him who gives and keeps his duty, and accepts what is good, we facilitate for him the way to ease. And as for him who is niggardly, and considers himself self-sufficient, and rejects what is good, we facilitate for him the way to distress. And his wealth will not avail him when he perishes. Surely ours is it to show the way, and surely ours is the hereafter and the former. So I warn you of the fire that flames. None will enter it but the most unfortunate who rejects the truth and turns his back. And away from it shall be kept the most faithful to duty, who gives his wealth purifying himself, and none has with him any boon for a reward except the seeking of the pleasure of his Lord, the Most High, and he will soon be well pleased. Surah 93, al Duha, the brightness of the day. In the name of Allah, the beneficent, the merciful, by the brightness of the day and the night when it is still, thy Lord has not forsaken thee, nor is he displeased, and surely the latter state is better for thee than the former. And soon will thy Lord give thee so that thou wilt be well pleased. Did he not find thee an orphan and give thee shelter and find thee groping so he showed the way and find thee in want so he enriched thee 
therefore the orphan oppress not, and him who asks chide not, and the favor of thy Lord proclaim. Surah 94, Al-Inshira, the expansion. In the name of Allah, the beneficent, the merciful, have we not expanded for thee thy breast, and removed from thee thy burden, which weighed down thy back, and exalted for thee thy mention? Surely with difficulty is ease. With difficulty is surely ease. So when thou art free from anxiety, work hard, and make thy Lord thy exclusive object. Surah 95, Altin, the fig. In the name of Allah, the beneficent, the merciful, by the fig and the olive and Mount Sinai and this city made secure, certainly we created man in the best make. Then we render him the lowest of the low, except those who believe and do good. So theirs is a reward never to be cut off. So who can give the lie to thee after this about the judgment? Is not Allah the best? Of the judges? Surah 96, Al Alaq, the clot. In the name of Allah, the beneficent, the merciful. Read in the name of thy Lord who creates, creates man from a clot. Read in thy Lord is most generous, who taught by the pen, taught man what he knew not. Nay, man is surely inordinate because he looks upon himself as self sufficient. Surely to thy Lord is the return. Hast thou seen him who forbids a servant when he prays? Seest thou if he is on the right way, or enjoins observance of duty? Seest thou if he denies and turns away? Knows he not that Allah sees? Nay, if he desist not, we will seize him by the forelock, a lying, sinful forelock. Then let him summon his counsel. We will summon the braves of the army. Nay, obey him not, but prostrate thyself, and draw nigh to Allah. This is an ayah of prostration. Allahu Akbar, Allahu Akbar. Subhan Rabil Allah, Subhan Rabil Allah, Subhan Rabil Allah. Allahu Akbar. Allahu Akbar. Subhan Rabil Allah, Subhan Rabil Allah, Subhan Rabil Allah. Allahu Akbar. Allahu Akbar. Subhanallah. Surah 97, Al Qadr majesty in the name of Allah the beneficent the merciful surely we revealed it on the night of majesty and what will make thee comprehend what the night of majesty is the night of majesty is better than a thousand months the angels and the spirit descend in it by the permission of their Lord for every affair peace it is till the rising of the morning surah 98 al Baina, the clear evidence in the name of Allah, the beneficent, the merciful, those who disbelieved from among the people of the book and the idolaters could not have been freed till clear evidence came to them, a messenger from Allah, reciting pure pages wherein are all right books. Nor did those to whom the book was given become divided till clear evidence came to them, and they are enjoined not but to serve Allah, being sincere to him in obedience, upright, and to keep up prayer and pay the poor rate, and that is the right religion." Those who disbelieve from among the people of the book and the idolaters will be in the fire of hell abiding therein. They are the worst of creatures. Those who believe and do good, they are the best of creatures. Their reward is with their Lord, gardens of perpetuity wherein flow rivers abiding therein forever. Allah is well pleased with them, and they are well pleased with him. That is for him who fears his Lord. Surah 99, Al-Zilzal, The Shaking in the name of Allah, the beneficent, the merciful, when the earth is shaken with her shaking, and the earth brings forth her burdens, and man says, What has befallen her? On that day she will tell her news, as if thy Lord had revealed to her. On that day men will come forth in sundry bodies, that they may be shown their works. So he who does an Adam's weight of good will see it, and he who does an Adam's weight of evil will see it. Surah 100, al adiyat the Assaulters. In the name of Allah, the Beneficent, the Merciful, by those running and uttering cries, and those producing fire, striking, and those suddenly attacking at morn, then thereby they raise dust, then penetrate thereby gatherings. Surely man is ungrateful to his Lord, and surely he is a witness of that. 
and truly on account of the love of wealth he is niggardly. Knows he not when that which is in the graves is raised and that which is in the breasts is made manifest? Surely, dear Lord, this day is aware of them. Surah 101, al Kaira. The Calamity In the name of Allah, the Beneficent, the Merciful. The Calamity! What is the Calamity? And what will make thee know how terrible is the Calamity? The day wherein men will be as scattered moths, and the mountains will be as carded wool. Then as for him whose measure of good deeds is heavy, he will live a pleasant life. And as for him whose measure of good deeds is light, the abyss is a mother to him. And what will make thee know what that is? A burning fire. Surah 102, al Takathir, the abundance of wealth. In the name of Allah, the beneficent, the merciful, abundance diverts you until you come to the graves. Nay, you will soon know. Nay, again, you will soon know. Nay, would that you knew with a certain knowledge. You will certainly see hell. Then you will see it with certainty of sight. Then on that day you shall certainly be questioned about the boons. Surah 103, Al-Asr, the time. In the name of Allah, the beneficent, the merciful, by the time surely man is in loss, except those who believe and do good and exhort one another to truth and exhort one another to patience. Surah 104, Al-Humaza, the slanderer, in the name of Allah, the beneficent, the merciful. Woe to every slanderer, defamer, who amasses wealth and counts it. He thinks that his wealth will make him abide. Nay, he will certainly be hurled into the crushing disaster. And what will make thee realize what the crushing disaster is? It is the fire kindled by Allah, which rises over the hearts. Surely it is closed in on them. In extended columns. Surah 105, Al Fil, the elephant. In the name of Allah, the beneficent, the merciful. Hast thou not seen how thy Lord dealt with the possessors of the elephant? Did he not cause their war to end in confusion and send against them birds and flocks, casting at them decreed stones? So he rendered them like straw eaten up. Surah 106, al Quraysh, the Quraysh. In the name of Allah, the Beneficent, the Merciful. For the protection of the Quraysh, their protection during their journey in the winter and the summer, so let them serve the Lord of this house, who feeds them against hunger and gives them security against fear. Surah 107, al Maun, Acts of Kindness. In the name of Allah, the Beneficent, the Merciful. Hast thou seen him who belies religion? That is the one who is rough to the orphan and urges not the feeding of the needy. So woe to the praying ones who are unmindful of their prayer, who do good to be seen and refrain from acts of kindness. Surah 108, al Kafar, The Abundance of Good In the name of Allah, the Beneficent, the Merciful, surely we have given the abundance of good. So pray to thy Lord and sacrifice. Surely thy enemy is cut off from good. Surah 109, Al-Kafirun, the disbelievers. In the name of Allah, the beneficent, the merciful, say, O believers, I serve not that which you serve, nor do you serve him whom I serve, nor shall I serve that which ye serve, nor do you serve him whom I serve. For you is your recompense, and for me, my recompense. Surah 110. Al Nasr, the help. In the name of Allah, the beneficent, the merciful. When Allah's help and victory comes, and thou seest men entering the religion of Allah in companies, celebrate the praise of thy Lord and ask his permission. Surely he is ever returning to mercy. Surah 111, Allah Hab, the flame. In the name of Allah, the beneficent, the merciful. Abu Lahab's hands will perish, and he will perish. His wealth and that which he earns will not avail him. He will burn in fire, giving rise to flames. And his wife, the bearer of slander, upon her neck, a halter of twisted rope. Surah 112, 
al-ikhlas, the unity. In the name of Allah, the beneficent, the merciful, say he, Allah, is one. Allah is he on whom all depend. He begets not, nor is he begotten, and none is like him. Surah 113, Al-Falaq, the dawn. In the name of Allah, the beneficent, the merciful, say, I seek refuge in the Lord of the dawn from the evil of that which he has created, and from the evil of intense darkness when it comes, and from the evil of those who cast evil suggestions in firm resolutions, and from the evil of the envier when he envies. Surah 114, Al-Naz, the men. In the name of Allah, the beneficent, the merciful, Say, I seek refuge in the Lord of men, the King of men, the God of men, from the evil of the whisperings of the slinking devil who whispers into the hearts of men, from among the jinn and the men. This is the conclusion of Part 30, Jews 30 of the Holy Quran. Allahu Akbar.